Hello everyone, welcome back to the channel. So it's Sunday, I want to wish everyone a good morning, I want to do a weekly review video. And I also want to do a special shout out for Mad Stacker in the Madhouse. Great group of people there. You guys will enjoy the Madhouse Mad Stacker's channel, I call his live, well his live streams are the Madhouse basically. But yeah, you guys are really going to enjoy that. I highly suggest you guys at least give it a chance. And yeah, if you like fun videos on Gold and Silver, please like, share, subscribe. I do upload videos basically every single morning. So yeah, like and subscribe. Hit the bell button if you do want the regular content. But yeah, so it's kind of the same old, same old this week. We have a lot of people talking about stimulus, a lot of people talking about the election, a lot of speculation on stimulus and the election and honestly it doesn't really change none of that really changes anything in my mind for my strategy on stacking maybe for some other things but not on my stacking strategy and this is kind of my thoughts on it there's gonna be a both sides want stimulus we've already had stimulus we, I was already anticipating another stimulus. So, if people now that we're speculating and that's now right in the forefront of the news, why would I change my mind if I already was kind was understanding that that's going to happen? If I already knew an election was going to happen this year, why would I change my strategy for any of that? That's just me, though. I'm not playing the, oh, this person wins, I'm stacking, this person wins, I'm not stacking. I'm a stacker. Period. Doesn't matter who wins. <clears throat> I will be stacking. And if the price goes down, I will take advantage. If the price goes up, I will be happy. That's the way I've always kind of done it. <clears throat> That's the way I always will do it. I don't like to think I know everything. I like... <clears throat> I like to be prepared for whatever happens. You never know what life is going to throw at you. Who knew about this pandemic that we're going through right now? Just my opinion though. I like to be ready for anything. I don't like to say I know the future. I know what's going to happen next. Nobody does. Anyone that says that. It's just a guess. It's just a guess. I've seen many people, oh, I got this right, and I got this right. Then you see someone who hears him on the third time and goes, oh, I'm going to do it exactly what he says. Invest a ton of money into something that that guy said to invest in, that he's investing in. Now you lost a lot. Because you're not thinking for yourself. You're not really... You, you kind of need to understand what's going on. You can't just say, oh... These things are going to happen right now. This guy knows everything. I'm just going to follow him. Like, you see... What that kind of reminds me of is, like, Warren Buffett. He's got, like, a cult following. I don't really get it. He's just a guy. He might be a smart investor. But he's just a guy. And for you to automatically assume that he's better than you are... Is really belittling to yourself. That's why I'm going to do my own thing. I'm going to be stacking. I'm a stacker. I'm not a... I stack if this happens. I stack if that happens. I stack. Period. That's just me. I really hope you guys enjoy. And... I'd love to know what you guys all think about your stacking strategy. And for me, all this speculation on all this stuff... Who's going to win the election? Who's going who won't win the election? What stimulus is going to be? Like especially for stimulus, I just don't I'm at the point where I'm Canadian. I don't really care. I don't get a check or anything like that. Why would it matter? Money's already being printed to the point where the economy is zombie companies. Why would I care? about how much more money is going to be printed. If we can't handle a 1% interest rate, we, like, what could you handle? Your financial system's so shaky if you can't handle a 1% interest rate. My goodness. I will be stacking. 
It doesn't matter really who wins, who loses. I'm a stacker, I will stack. And that kind of sums it all up for my weekly review with all the speculation on everything and how it's in everywhere nowadays. But yeah, kind of wraps it up. Please go check out the Madhouse. Please go check out Mad Stacker. I'm sure you guys will enjoy. Stay positive. See you next time. Thanks. Bye.